Good day. Welcome to BitPoss Point of Sale tutorial. In this tutorial we will learn on how to use the void feature of the program. Voiding a transaction means that the inventory of that transaction will go back to the inventory of the system. And the amount of that transaction will be refunded to the customer or to be used in tendering other product that the customer wants to buy instead of the refunded item or items. In the cashiering interface you can see the void icon in the lower portion of the display. It has also its keyboard shortcut which is Control V. How to void when you are in OR activated. First, get the receipt of your customer and look for the receipt number. Press the void button or use the keyboard shortcut. Control V. When using your cashier account you need an admin to confirm your voiding. After the admin logged in, you need to input the OR number or in other words the receipt number. You are asked to put the reason for voiding. This memo will appear in the sales detail report. The system will confirm that the OR number you entered has been successfully voided. After a couple of seconds the OR number in the sales information at the right of the screen will become zero in value. How to void when you are still in SO sales order receipt. First, when the transaction is still new, you can see the OR number of that SO in the sales information at the right. If the transaction was already old and you can't locate the OR number of that SO receipt, you must go to the back office of the BitPoss and produce a POS sales detail report. Ask the owner or the supervisor to log in in the back office using an admin account to produce the sales detail report. Press Ctrl F so that you can enter the SO number, and it will navigate to that SO number and you can locate the OR number. Press Alt Tab and press the void button and let the admin log in so that you can proceed the voiding. Enter the OR number of that SO receipt and enter the reason for voiding. The POS will confirm that the OR number you entered was already voided in the system. That's how do the voiding or the refund feature in the BitPoss point of sales. This has been Tech James. See you in the next tutorial. Subscribe for more BitPoss tutorials and new product reveal. Thank you.